a smartphone video. It's running rampant in the world, isn't it? What's up, socials? Happy Sexy Wednesday. I highly encourage smartphone video. Our iPhones are making video that might be better than this Canon T4i that I bought. I'm like, why am I even using this big thing? I could just put my smartphone up here and it would do a great job. But when you're doing on-the-go video, Video is not necessarily the factor because our cameras can do this gorgeous, flawless HD. However, audio is what will kill a video if it is not good. Yes, we're still settling for bad images. But when the audio sucks, we're like, peace out. That's why today I wanted to tell you about my little secret for on the go video. Cause when I travel, I don't bring my gear. I just use my iPhone 6 plus and my Rode SmartLav microphone. I'm not using it right now because I actually prefer a boom mic when I'm using an in-studio setup. But when I'm out and about outside or just traveling and things are kind of crazy and I can't really control the environment around me, it's very important that I have a microphone other than what's built into the phone. That's what I use the Rode SmartLav for. I just carry it around in my purse or in my suitcase or whatever the case may be for you because you just literally pull it out of the bag clip it on and plug it into your phone. It's that easy, my friends. The fact that you can just plug a microphone into your smartphone and the smartphone just knows what to do with it is awesome. Take advantage of it. There's no reason why you can't buy a very, very economical and easy tool to upgrade your smartphone video so you don't have to go buy a bunch of gear. The boom mic, the fancy camera, the lights, the this, the that. Okay, how about this? Go outside, natural lighting, smartphone, lavalier. You're good to go. There are a lot of different types of smartphone friendly microphones on the market, but I prefer Rode, which is what I use here in studio for the boom mic as well as the lavalier. One thing I do recommend is that this mic is very good. So as much as you might want to clip it really close to your face, you really don't have to. You could probably have it outside of the frame. See, I would probably clip it down below and it will be just as effective. Test it out, listen to the audio on your smartphone and make sure it's what you want it to be before you go full blown making a video. Always, always, always good to test. Especially if you're in the habit of filming all your videos for yourself. Definitely check out the Rode Smart Love and any of the equipment that I recommend is on the resources page at Savvy Sexy Social. Just go to SavvySexySocial.com slash resources. Those will be all of my Amazon affiliate links for you to go and engage in some tech for your setup. That's all for today, socials. Thank you so much for tuning in. I appreciate it as always, and I'll see you tomorrow.